Okay, guys, it is November 18th, and we still got plants outside. I guess I've been doing this since 2008, and I believe this is the latest they've ever been outside by far. They've been outside almost every day this week. In the last week, they're out every day. So that is very crazy. Never had to happen before. We got some crazy warm weather. It feels more like South Carolina than it does uh, Pennsylvania, especially this time of year. Normally, it's snowing by now, but they're all doing really good. Start over here. The fig got new leaves growing. And everything's adjusting to being inside and half outside. These guys have been outside a lot. The ones in the garage haven't, haven't been for uh, a couple weeks now. Doing good. This one's doing good. Kind of plant. You can see new leaves growing down there. Cactus looking good. These are from California. The Robutians, uh, it came up, but then something happened when like, the Wookie came up. And now it's. It's still, there's still roots, but I'm not sure what the heck's doing. So I'm just left it there. Coconut tree is looking really good. We have new leaf growing here coming up. So that's plants looking really healthy. We got the Hawaiian flowers. These are the ones you have on your legs. Looking really good. You can see a lot of new leaves growing there. But this is very healthy plant. Same as this one back here. And the last but not least, we have the passion fruit, which blew over. That's why some things are in the corner. Tall things are in the corner. Looking really good. We got a lot of new leaves growing. It is a really cool, interesting looking vine. This is not what I expected my plant to seeds, but in the being a viney plant. So they're all doing really good. I'm very happy how everything looks up here. And I'll take you guys. This is kind of the part of summer now. Going out the outside version. It's just so nice out right now. I'll give you guys an update on what's going on. We planted these back in the ground. They're trying to die for the year. We put the, the pine berries and the normal strawberries together. So we're going to have a big mix next year of uh, both of them. And you got this is the blueberries in November. It leaves a couple of leaves left up here. Pretty much everything's getting ready. You can see the new buds for next year. Everything's looking good here. So this looks like in the winter time or fall slash winter. That's looking really good. Okay, now into the garage. I'm gonna take an outside to make route. A couple of leaves left in the tree. Not like too much. Hey. All the leaves are gone now. And here we are, here's the outside version. We lost the lights. This, this wasn't even the gray lights, the normal. I don't even know why I'm trying to do that. Here's that rich. I'm using my head. See, the normal line there, all the rest are grow lights. This is looking good. We got another one grow flower open up there. This one of them looks like it's from earlier in a week. But are we doing really good. We got the limes doing good. A lot of green leaves, new leaves starting to grow. We got the banner tree back there, so like this leaves gonna be opening up in a day or two. Looking really good. Lemon tree looking good. We got these new leaves here, the mature leaves. And we got some baby leaves starting to grow too. So they're all looking really, really healthy. Really happy how it looks. Right now it is 68 degrees in here. 52 humidity. Looking really good. Humidity is right where I want it to be. The big orange tree is looking good, even though we lost a couple leaves. Because of the light, we still all can see right here. Brand new leaves grown, and we got a lot of new leaves grown there. So that's looking really good. We got the banana tree here grown. We got look down there. Newly starting to pop up. These plants are still trying to adjust. These plants aren't, aren't outside as much as other ones. Actually, not at all since I brought them in here. And last but not least, we have the um, passion, not passion fruit, pomegranate, if I could talk. Every time we got new leaves growing there, all these plants are starting to recover now. They've been inside for a couple weeks now and they're definitely starting to adjust. They're all doing really, really good. This is the one I have to water twice a week. Everything else gets watered on Saturday. That's how I did it last year. And then upstairs plants, since they're upstairs in the heat and warm, warm and half outside, they also get watered um, twice a week too. But everything else gets watered once a week. So these plants are all doing really, really good. I'm very happy how they're doing so far. And I'm going to make a couple more changes before it really starts getting cold. But I think all these plants are doing really good. So. Thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed it, any questions, leave it in the comment section. I'll hopefully I can answer them. So if you guys enjoyed this video, I'll see you guys next week. So thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys later.